Welcome to this Anif tutorial video. In this video, we will get to know the web user interface of Anif. The command line is great for administrative tasks such as setting up and training Anif, but for simply testing Anif with various texts, the command line is not so handy. For that purpose, there exists the web user interface, which can be used in any web browser. The web user interface is started on the command line. The command is unif run. If you are running unif within a docker container, you need to add also a host option, dash dash host 0.0.0.0. The option can be added also when not using docker. The web UI is now running. If wanted, it could be stopped by pressing Ctrl C. To use the web user interface, I open a web browser and I go to address localhost. I use port 5000 by adding a colon and 5000. Here we find the web UI. There is a big empty field where the text to get suggestions for can be typed or copy paste. For example, here I copy paste the introduction part from the Wikipedia article about the National Library of Finland. On the right, there is a menu for selecting a project. I select a TF-IDF project. The suggestions can be fetched by clicking this button. Here are the suggested subjects. Each label acts as a web link to the URI, and the bars visualize the scores that Anif assigns to the suggestions. The maximum number of shown suggestions can be selected with these buttons. There is also a link to the interactive documentation of the API. The documentation shows some details of the methods of the ANIF API. This video demonstrated the web user interface of ANIF. Thank you for watching.